storm with round one. Blue team, have a look at this. the fast and furious world of Thundercat racing, we sent Jamie, Fred, Ramesh and Tom to the Isle of Wight for the challenge. It was red versus blue with three points up for grabs to the winning team. Now, Fred, you always seem to win these motorsport challenges whenever, you, whenever we do them. Were you confident going in? I was looking forward to it, yeah. We got yeah. Ramesh. Tom was never driven. Right. You know, he's a big lad, isn't he, to get around in one of them little boats? You know, he, sure. He stepped in the water, never mind global warming, the <laughs> levels went up. <laughs> I mean, I've got to be honest, I was worried about all of you doing this challenge, but, Jamie, the Isle of Wight Council, they actually got in touch with us with some of their concerns. Not for safety, they were worried about your hair dye causing... <laughs> no, they were, because it was Cow's Week soon, they were worried it was some kind of oil slick. Uh, Listen, there's a new threat in town, this guy. Yeah. Since he's joined the show, massive makeover, Fred, isn't he? What are you talking yeah. about? Oh, really. <laughs> he had a hairdresser doing his hair up yeah, after he, helmet. He's a joke. Yeah. Did you take your yeah. own hairdresser? No, for... I did not take my own hair. And you've been dyeing that? I've not been dyeing it. Look, I, look, look at me. Does it look like I've had a makeover? I look like shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Romesh, how did you feel going into this challenge? Well, look, I'm, uh, I'm a son of an immigrant family, so I've been taught to distrust boats. You know? <laughs> Let's take a look and see how our guys got on in training. Hey guys, today we're heading over to the Isle of Wight because we're going to be racing these. Teams, Freddie and Tom, and Ramesh and Jamie. Yes. One of you is going to be the driver, and one of you is going to be the co-driver. What's the easiest thing to do out of the two? Co-drive. Oh, I'll, I'll do that, Fred. I'm worried I'm not even going to fit in. I think we're going to need a bigger ball, Tom. We're going to give you some lessons. We're going to teach you guys how to properly co-pilot, so then later when we teach you how to drive, that you can work as a team. Oh, fuck's sake! Fuck. Yeah, go. On. Let's just go steady all the way. No, you don't want to go steady all the way, cos you want to win the race, like I, that. I'm not that bothered. <laughs> go on, give it some. Come on, there you go. Turn forward! That's it! Just lean out a bit when we're turning. Spot on, mate. Perfect. Oh, my God, oh, my God! We've not been going full tilt, and I've already shut myself. Come on! Yeah, it's all right, it's fun. Oh, oh. I don't know how Ramesh and I are going to do this. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Because he's as scared as I am. I thought I had this in the bag. I'm fucking terrified. <laughs> My horse is going to feel sick. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. So, Jay, what we're going to do is get you to drive straight away, mate. Throttling, pull towards you. Okay. I'm pretty shit at everything like this. This is my idea of heaven. A little ice cream on the seafront. Open it up, open it up, go on. Jamie's going, but he looks like one of the pinchers on those scooters you see going up and down the high street. Ah! It's moving, but we're in gumption. I told you I was shit at this. <laughs> and Womish looks absolutely. Womish looks like he's sunbathing. The hard towards it, now for speed again. Oh, God. Go, go, go. Jamie's yeah. having a go here. Yeah? Fucking hell. <laughs> you alright, boy? You said I'm unbelievable. I see you got quicker, though. You're taking a fist, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> you alright or not, really? Were you alright? No, nah, rubbish. Have you ever driven some of this, Tom? No, I've never driven anything. Perfect. <laughs> I am desperate for Freddy to be shit at this. That dream crushing. And Tom is just having a nice day out of the beach by the looks of it. Oh, is that right, man? Yeah, Tom's a joke. It's actually embarrassing. Hard <laughs> <laughs> towards you. That's it. Easy. Nailed it. Fred's getting to me a little bit now. There's no limit to the shit sports that Freddie's done, oh, including just... cricket. <laughs> Tom is going for it. Oh!
brutal. That is brutal. I did think we were going straight on the beach then. <sighs> yeah, I did. Thank you. Sorry for nearly killing you. <laughs> I have no idea we were that close to the beat. <laughs> Genuinely looking at it, that geezer with me, who was the expert, shat himself hard. <laughs> well, after that, the trainer took the wise decision that Tom would not be allowed to pilot the boat. <laughs> he actually said, if he pilots the boat, we're going to shut the whole thing down. So, how did you feel about that, Tom? Well, I'm going to just say another thing, actually. They were a right <laughs> gaggle of pricks. <laughs> All of them, fellas. And I'll say it here. If you to watch it, they were a gaggle of pricks. <laughs> They were so up themselves about a shitty little sport I'd never even heard of. I had to rave it on with them, looking down their nose at me. Now, I'll say it straight, right? Yeah, and the worst thing of it all, and this is the worst thing, is this was the one time, like, BAFTA aside and all that, my dad was like, do not let me down in front of Freddie Flintoff. <laughs> do not let me down. And I was mortified when I was careering into that beach. <laughs> Rummy. Is it as scary as it looks, Alvin? I swear, honestly, mate, it's one of the most frightening things I've ever done. Like, that was... I, I was ready to walk after that. It was, it was, it was so frightening. And, and they're laughing, obviously. They're loving it. <laughs> oh, look, he's crying, he's crying. Look at he's crying. <laughs> Just being absolute gits about it. But, yeah, it was, it's properly terrifying. Fred, properly frightening. Fred looked good, didn't he? Well, this yeah. is the thing. You looked like you were terrific at it. Was it, even, was it ever tr difficult for you? you know, anything driving, anything to do with speed on... Within reason. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, I love it. I, I really enjoy it. That's the one thing I love. Now, Jamie and Ron, before the race, you had to pick who would pilot and who would co-pilot. Who did you go for? Ron. As captain, I just thought he's... You know, sometimes you've got to defer and know your qualities. And this man was unbelievable in practice. Really? really uh, yeah, amazing. We had to tailor a few things because, to start with, when we first set out the course, we we're going to have to go to his right, which is no good because he can't see out of his right eye. <laughs> I can see out my right. I've just got a lazy eye, Jack. You're not blind in one eye, No, you way, said you had to go He's left. Not... <laughs> I think you said you had to go left. He said to me, it's all left turn, so it favours your good side. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. Well, it's that time now. Vladimir, who would, you, who would you put your money on here? Would you put your money on Freddie and Tom or Ramesh and Jamie? Of course, I'm Freddie and Tom. You're going to go Freddie and Tom yeah. for the win? All right, well, let's head back to the Isle of Wight for the race. Cows on the Isle of Wight is the setting for the A League of Their Own Powerboat Challenge. The rules are simple. Both Thundercat teams will complete one short lap and one long lap around this course. Freddie's blue team will do their short lap first around the middle mark, whilst Jamie's red team complete the long lap. They will then have to swap routes, the blue team taking the long leg and the red team taking the short one, before they can power to the finish line. But the race will start on the beach with a quick dash to the boats. Conditions are good and we're all set to go. Freddie's been so impressive in training. The question is, have the red team got anything in the locker? Three. Two, one, go! Jamie gets a bit of a flying start and gets a shove through his troubles as well. <laughs> oh, Tom's taking Jamie down. That's not in the rule, but... What are you doing, Tom? Try again. Come on, Tom, get in love. Go on, Ramesh! Freddie on the throttle of the blue boat, Ramesh on the throttle of the red boat. And what a start by the red boat! Jamie and Ramesh are off to an absolute flyer as they head up towards the first mark. Go on, Tom. <laughs> the blue boat with plenty of work to do already. Ramesh, you're on fire! Come on! Forward, Leap forward, Fred says. Oh, that's massive there going round the middle mark as the blue boat turns to do the short lap first. Look at the difference. Jamie leaning into the turn, Tom leaning back. Come on, boy! Jamie loving it as his red boat heads down the course to complete their long lap. Yeah! What up on my nautical hand signals? Well, I think that means we're in the lead. Where's Rob now? The blue boat's approaching its last turn to get onto the home stretch. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> 
Jamie and Ramesh have just got to get around the middle mark. But here come Freddie and Tom, full throttle. <laughs> but they're running out of time as the red boat pulls in front. Get in there! This has been really impressive stuff from the red boat, and they've won it! Robes and Jamie have ripped up the ball book from training. Such a great drive. Yes! I thought it might. Can you feel it? Can you feel it? Congratulations to Robes and Jamie, the champions! Out there on the water! Who knew? Sensational! And that's three points to the red team. Well done. Can we say a huge thank you to Thundercat Racing and everyone at Universal Marina. We'll be right back after this short break.